So, hello and welcome, this is Low End Gaming. Today in this video we will tweak a 2017 online multiplayer game called Fortnite. So, welcome to the ultimate lag fix guide for Fortnite. In this video I will make sure that you can play Fortnite on your low end PCs without any lag and stutters. For proof, see this was Fortnite before doing any optimizations and this is Fortnite fully optimized. Before starting with the process, let's talk about the minimum requirements of the game. Please don't skip this part. According to me, to run this game you should have at least 4GB RAM, any dual-core or quad-core processor and any internal or external graphics with DirectX 11 supported feature level. To check if your graphics support DirectX 11, then type DXDiag in the search bar and click on it. Then in the display, you will see 11 written in the feature levels. If you have it then good, if not then you can't run this game. It will show this error. So, if you pass the minimum system requirements for the game then let's get started with the process. So, this video is divided into parts. Internal tweaks. And external tweaks. Let's get started with the internal tweaks. For the first step we will change the in-game settings. So, open the game and go to settings. Now follow me. Make sure that window mode is full screen. Then change the resolution to lowest available or set to your monitor's native resolution. Mine is 1366 by 768. Then set frame rate limit to unlimited. Change the quality preset to low. Then change 3D resolution to 35%. Now change the rendering mode to performance. And turn on multi-thread rendering. Copy my other settings as it is. Then make sure to set the matchmaking region to auto. This will lower your ping in game thus causing less or no lag. Now, click on apply and restart your game so that the new changes are applied. After this step try playing your game, hope that now your game is running better than before. But don't worry if you still face lag and stutters, because we just started. 4. The second step we will edit the config file of the game. This step is very important so make sure to follow me carefully. For the config file, type percentage local app data percentage and open the folder. Then find Fortnite game folder. Saved. Config. Windows client. Gamer user settings is the config file. Before editing make sure that the file is not set to read only. Now, right click on it and click on edit. Now follow me. Change ray tracing shadow quality to false. Ray tracing reflections quality to zero. Ray tracing ambient occlusion quality to false. And ray tracing AO quality to zero. Then go all the way down. And change the resolution quality to 30. We are done. Just save the file and make sure to set it to red only. Now, after this step it may happen that some in-game settings may be reset to default. Just change them to low after changing the config. So, after editing the config try your game. This is how Fortnite works after this step. If you feel that it is too blurry to play then, in the config file change the resolution quality to 35 or 40. So, hope now that your game is working way smoother than before. So, guys we are done with the internal steps. If you are still watching this video then make sure to like the video. Now, we will start with external steps, so let's go. Now, we will do some basic tweaks and optimize our PC for better in-game performance. But before making any changes to your PC, make sure that you create a restore point. So, if anything goes wrong, then we can revert back all the changes in one click. To create a restore point, right-click on my PC and go to Properties. Then in the Advanced System Settings click on Create. Now we are safe to do the tweaks. Now just follow me. First, type background apps in the search and open it. Then here turn off background apps or keep on only those which you need. Second, go to display settings in the graphics settings at the executable file of Fortnite. After adding, click on options and set it to high performance. Third, now go to settings. Then click on gaming. Then make sure that Xbox game bar is turned off and also make sure that the game mode is turned on. 
Fourth, press Windows plus R key and open Run dialog box. Then type temp and hit OK. Then select all the files and delete them permanently by pressing Shift plus Delete key. Now once more, type percentage temp percentage in the Run dialog box. Then do the same and delete all the files. Now once again, type Perfetch in the Run dialog box and delete all the files in the folder. So, now our Windows is fully optimized to play Fortnite. Now, for the next step, we will use some softwares that will help to increase FPS in Fortnite. Let's go, but if you are still watching this video, make sure to comment. Victory Royale. So, high ping in Fortnite or any other online multiplayer game can easily cause even if you have a high-end PC. To fix that high ping problem, I have an app. The name is DNS Jumper. Link is in the description below. Download and install it. Now open it. Go to fastest DNS server and click on start DNS test. Now wait for some time. After the test is done, click on apply DNS server. And we are done. Your ping problem will be solved. You can use this app every time you play Fortnite or any other online game. Let's move to the second app. Now, we will optimize our CPU to run Fortnite on highest performance. The second app is called Process Lasso Tool. Link is in the description below. Download and install it. Now open it and minimize it. Then open your game and minimize the game. Then open the Process Lasso app. Now follow me. Click on Main and make sure that Performance Mode is enabled. Then find Fortnite Service and right-click on it. Set CPU priority always to high. In the CPU affinity make sure that all the cores are selected. Set input output priority always to high. In application power profile select bit some highest performance. Then enable induce performance mode. Then click on more and enable disable idle saver. Now we are done. Just restart the game all the settings will be applied but make sure that process lasso keeps running in the background. So, guys that was it for this video. Hope now that, you are able to play Fortnite on your PC smoothly without any lag and stutters. If this video helped you then make sure to leave a like and if you are new to my channel then make sure to click on that red, subscribe button. If you have any problem, you can join my Discord community link in the description below or you can just ask me in the comments below. See you all in the next video. Bye. Peace.